Hello and welcome to Yacht Otter. So this is just a short video just to introduce you to the facilities on the boat for your overnight stays. Um, the first thing I want to show you, perhaps one of the most important things, is the gas. And we keep the gas closed at all times really, unless we're actually using the cooker. So to access the, the gas locker, simply press in this little button here and then it hinges from the back forward like that and there you have your two gas bottles this is a spare this is the one that's hooked up as you can see and it's simply this little valve on the top so to open up the gas let's just open it up so having used and had a you know had your cup of tea then just get into the routine and habit of just popping out here again and just closing the gas down so that when you're not using the cooker then the gas is closed and we're nice and safe Okay. So when you arrive, the boat's going to be open, but just to show you how we close up the boat and open it again, uh, we simply have this sliding hatch, so we can push that forward. And then this is what we call the washboard. So we're just gonna literally just lift that out of its slots and we can put this down. We've actually got, just for completion, we've got, just to show you, if we open up this cockpit locker here, we can actually stow this washboard away on its little shelf, which is just here. Notice the little handle just drops into a slot there, stowed. And then we can close this lock up. Okay, let's go down below. First thing, got some quite steep steps here. So what we're going to do is actually turn ourselves around and go safely down backwards. You can grab a hold and we're nice and safe. And welcome to the boat. Okay, so here we are down below. So let's go through some basic things here. First of all, most importantly, the galley. Um, let's have a quick look around here. So lots of nice storage space up here, as you can see. I think this cupboard has got your plates and bowls. This one has got your glasses, mugs, and so on. So all essentials. And then these are all nice and empty. So lots of space to put all your bits and pieces. Nice big fridge here. So just be aware guys that to close the fridge, this little button here, just pull it out and then it releases it. So it clicks in position to release, just pull it out and down she comes. Just be gentle with it. Just put it down nice and gently. Double sink here with a little mixer tap. You will have hot water because we'll be hooked up to the pontoon, to the shore supply of power. So we'll have nice piping hot water and a mixer tap there, as I say. Underneath the sinks, here we have the bin and here's all the cleaning materials and, <clears throat> and so on in there. These two drawers, we've got cutlery and we've got cooking equipment and another big storage bin just underneath here. Beneath the cooker, if we just take a look in this locker, we've got all the pots and pans. So that's the storage of those. Okay, the cooker, most important, and um, we need to be safe. So what we do is we can turn on the gas because we're about to use them. I've just done it, I've just turned it on. And so let's have a look. So. These two are operating the two burners on the top. So I'm going to turn this one on. So the first thing to do is simply twist it 90 degrees. And then what we need to do is press this in to get the gas and then light it. There we go. And hold this in for two or three seconds. And off she goes. We can, obviously we've got, okay. And then switch off. So this, third one here is for the oven. Okay, so once you've had your cup of tea and you're done with the cooker, remember, turn the gas off at the bottle. So you've got three individual cabins on the boat. You also have the saloon area, so you've got plenty of space. Um, let's just take a look at this aft cabin. This is on the starboard side, on the right hand side, so this starboard aft cabin. 
and um, all very straightforward just go for your lives in there um, you'll find little lights they have their own individual switches on the lights themselves um, in this cabin we have the battery switches they are all going to be on when you arrive and please leave them on you know that's what we need in order to have all the systems working so we just simply leave them on okay so the next thing i want to show you are the heads what we call the heads the loo so let's take a look in here okay i'm going to climb in here all right then so nothing to be scared of just a nice normal loo um to be honest guys when we're actually tied up in the marina then we're always going to choose to use the marina facilities um, but if you get caught short in the middle of the night or whatever, then clearly let's show you the loo. And of course, when we're at sea, then um, during the day, then you're going to be using the loo here too. So I'm going to show you how to use it. Okay, so uh, we've just got the simple pump mechanism here. And do your business. And then to flush the loo, we simply select the flush position here with this little black button and pump away. And what you want to do is give it loads of loads of water so I usually give it about 20 pumps so give it plenty and when it's all flushed away then we can simply put the little lever back to dry bowl position and then pump the loo dry there we go and that's how we leave it in the dry bowl position okay so nice and simple 